Okay, let's get started. <laughs> all right, so I'm starting with my coconut oil. I am applying that all over my head. You guys know I love this oil so much. It keeps my hair moisturized. Um, yeah, then I'm brushing it, the sides and the back. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then I am going to apply my Murray's Beeswax. I apply it mostly on the tips of my hair. Um, it seals it in, it seals that moisture in before I'm ready to curl my hair. Then I'm taking a little hairspray. Take your Paul Mitchell Freeze and Shine or whichever one you like. I'm starting at the back of my head and I'm going to go forward. Start that one curl, bam. And just to let you know, that these curls do not have to be in a particular formation. It doesn't have to be the way, exactly the way I'm doing it. As it goes on, you'll see that I am actually, you know, doing the flips, I mean, the curls different ways. So there are flips in there too. So you'll flip it back, you'll flip it forward, you'll flip it to the side, just as long as it's a great curl and it's in a way that you're able to style it and it won't stick up and look crazy. So yeah, so just keep curling, keep curling until you get to the front. So you can see I have some flip back, some flip forward, some flip to the side, you know, all of that. Now when you start getting closer to the front, I usually flip everything back. Those side pieces I'll flip back, but kind of in a, not directly back, but kind of like a slant to it, like an angle back to it. So it won't look like grandma curls. <laughs> Yeah, keep curling, keep curling, again to that front. And then the very front is where you flip it up so you can have that pompadour look. And make sure that these curls are kind of tight. Um, my, the length of my hair, this is tight for my length, but not like too, too tight. If your hair is longer, you can go tighter just so you can have more of that curliness to this pompadour style. Spray it again, then I'm taking my rake comb, and I'm not really combing it, combing it, I'm picking through it, and then I'll pick through it again with the rest of, with my hands, um, and then I'll take my rat tail and kind of pick through it some more. Like, I'm really showing you guys that the style process is really what matters, that finished style process of, you know, after you do all the curling and all of that, you come in and you just really pick through it and make sure that, you know, every hair is in place. Like, I'm really particular about the hair being in place. So, yeah, keep picking, keep, keep picking until you get that style that you want and that, that you like and you're satisfied with. Pick, pick, pick. So yeah, you're gonna check the back out, make sure everything is looking good, you can rake it. Um, I usually rake it, I don't curl the sides and back of my hair, I don't really like to, and then the way it's cut, I just like it to lay. Um, you can curl the back if you want, but I don't. And then, add a little more spray to it, and there you have it. It's your curly pompadour short hairstyle. Um, it's another easy look. It doesn't take a whole lot. Um, yeah, so there it is. Hope you guys like.